Hello folks, today we're taking a first look at Spellsword Cards Dungeon Top. And here I am, here's me with my pert bottom, venturing into the dungeon to fight an elf on a shelf or something like that. So this is a new roguelite dungeon crawler about to hit Steam Early Access on the 15th of January 2020. I think there's already been an alpha period at some point. Um, so this is a deck building um, and turn based battle style game where synergies between cards is everything. And it's by 1UP Plus, and thanks to them for giving me a, an early key to try this out. And I remain Jamie from Randomised User, with the first video recorded in 2020, lads! Right, so I think at the moment we're just going to move around the board. We can't go through those doors. And we're going to have a, have a fight with the Goblin Scout. Very straightforward so far. So this is the meat of the game. The fighting. Tonk. All about positional play. Synergy between cards. And let's see, what do we, we've got a, a, a minion who can fight... On his first turn, got shield, and we've got a rager whose every turn his attack will increase. Um, so I think I'll actually keep. Actually, no, I'll, I'll get rid of this. I'll redraw this card for our battle, so I'll get a different one. And in fact, we've also instead we've got a guardian, which is quite helpful, a bit more of a defensive card. I won't go through the rules too much because it's familiar to people. If you've seen this sort of um, game before, you'll probably know what the hell is going on. And if not, who cares? It's actually quite straightforward this one. So I'm there. I, I can move and attack in one turn. And this lad. Very straightforward, and um, we can only move once and attack once. Uh, he will be able to cast on the next go a multi-strike, a couple of minions. So let's try and get stuck in as quickly as possible. Let's move him to there, and then well, what I'll do is I'll cast that there. So if he casts anything there or there, it'll, um, the, the, the minion will take damage. Um, let's cast, let's put him, let's put him there. And this haste guy, I'm going to go get stuck in straight away. So he can move on this turn, the others can't. So I'm just going to attack him for that. He'll be sacrificed because he's only got one um, health. And um, that's all I can do now. Bang and bang. Now they cannot move on straight away, so I can get rid um, onto attacking. And you can only cast adjacent to an existing unit. So it's good to try and surround them as quickly as possible, if you can. Now he's going to throw a dagger... Um, in it's going to be horizontal, vertical, up to two squares. So at the moment, that's probably just going to take out him. But let's let's be tonking. I mean, I could move him out of the way now, which unfortunately puts him in the sights of my hero. Um, you're basically trying to kill the other hero to win a battle. You don't have to kill every other unit. Now my haste guy I might move him over here and then tonk him. I think you can shoot over the lads though, so that's, that's not going to protect me. So I'll probably uh, move out of the way a bit. I'm going to f uh, shoot my javelin card at him, taking him down to three health. And now, let's see. I mean, he can still move. In fact, what I'll do, get rid of him and all. I'll also be able to cast my... Ooh, I can cast my haste and tonk him, like that. Uh, and he is just a guy who can... He just got a ranged attack. So I'm going to lose some cards, but who cares, because I'm safe over here. I'll, I'll I'll put him there. And there's not really much he can do now to me. He'll attack me, but he won't get rid of my health. In this, when you actually do lose, your hero does lose health, that does carry over. So it's best to protect your hero as much as possible. And now I'll just tonk him. Oh, hang on. There we go. Sorted. First battle, very straightforward. 15 experience points, get myself some loot. I can take two of these, or I can go for more if I want to spend these kind of flare stones up here. Which is whatever. Right, try a weapon out. So I can give this to my hero. Power 2. Hero gains 1 extra attack each turn. Holy shit, that's good. I'll, I'll keep that one. Um, I'll turn over... Let's get a new minion. Oh, doggy! Yes, I've got a hound. Hounds are very good. I'll keep you and all. In fact, I will spend one of my stones. Hopefully this will be a... Yes, it's a health potion. Make sure that I select them. Confirm. And they'll be added to my deck. Let's go to the blacksmith and upgrade something. So I can upgrade any of my cards. I'm going to upgrade my doggy for free. Future upgrades will cost treasure, which I haven't found yet. So I can't. Right now. Goblin Warrior, still only level one. I'm not going to avoid the fight. It starts off as um, giving you the choice of being able to run away from a fight, guaranteed. And then the percentages go down each time, from like 100% to 75% to 50%. Right, so we've got a javelin. We can immediately tonk him a little bit. Now, I don't know... Sometimes it's a good idea to, um, if you can get, get just like, um, haste minions out, 
you might be able to surround him immediately and make it so he can't cast a few things, depending on the um, the enemy. But this one, I think I'll um, I think I'll I'll redraw one of the guardians. Try and get a more aggressive one. Oh yeah, I've got doggy. Yes, good. Right, so it's automatically changed my weapon for me. You can actually do that when you're outside in the actual dungeon itself, but it's already done that. So I gain an extra attack per turn. Holy shit, that's so, that seems suspiciously good. But, however, I mean, my hero isn't necessarily the one who's going to be doing the fighting, because I need to protect my precious 12 hearts. Right, so let's move a bit further in, actually. Let's, um, this actually got, my, my doggy does actually have haste. It's also got, it's actually quite strong, four hit points. He can only attack for one. Uh, his first card is going to be gain one power to the end of your turn. That's not great. That puts him up to attack two. But he won't be casting any minions just yet. So Guardian-wise, I'll leave that. Hang on. Oh, let's just toss my Javelin. Mate. I'll put me Doggy... Ooh, where shall I put him? Well, what I'll do is, is what I'll do. I'll put my Guardian out. There. Then I'll cast... I'm just wondering whether I should like try and run away, attack him and run away, but I don't see a huge amount of point. Let's just tonk him. Nope. Wait for it. There we go. So I could move away, but I don't see any real percentage in doing that. As you um, level up your character, you, you can give him things, extra things like um, being able to move twice in a turn. Oh shit, he's got a double attack thing going on. Ow. My dog's dead. That wasn't ideal. Right, so we've got two... Oh, we've got two... Uh, we've got two ranger minions. They're not great. Um, well, let's attack him. First, he's got six left. Um, I don't really want to get stuck in with you just now. Let's put you there. In fact, let's put you there. And... This is going to be... He's going to start sending out his minions, which... They're pretty poor, but you have to attack them twice to really hurt them. To actually get rid of them. They're like basically like crap shields. So, don't need to use my potion. However, if I don't use it, it's kind of going to... Hmm. No, I'll just keep it. If I actually do use it, the card's gone forever. But So I might as well just um, keep it in reserve. Yeah, he's got rid of my who gives a shit uh, ranger. Right, so this is good. We should be able to finish him off in one now. Especially, well, yeah, because I could just move him to there and tonk him. And he should be able to move in and attack twice. I think that's how it works. Um, let's give it a go. And there. So for once, my hero actually went in and did the tonking. That double attack thing is actually very handy. So I've got some more loot. Give myself a new spell, which is... Uh, this isn't great. Exhaust a random minion in your hand and apply burn to a unit equal to the exhausted minion's power. Uh, it's it's not great. Ah, this is a card I've never had before. Fury Master, power 2, hit points 4. Each turn power increases by 1. Ooh, that's good. It's like a better version of... Uh, yeah, because it's like a, an upgraded version of something I've already got. Definitely having you. Um, Anyone else? I think I'll take this, even though it's not hugely useful. Not, not going to spend any more. Ah, here we go, upgrading my lad. So I can either gain 4 HP, gain 2 at the end of every battle, or I can move 2. I'm going to go for the move 2. And that'll unlock further things. Right, random event. A circular portal with a dial stands alone in this room. It looks like there's something missing from this dial. Insert treasure. Well, I have no treasure at the moment. Just to confirm that. Yes. You just find that randomly in, in various loot situations. So, sadly, there's nothing I can do there. I don't think I can revisit it either. We've got a Goblin Berserker there, level 2. Or a Goblin Wrangler, level 1. I think we get to the stage where we can actually fight level 2 enemies. Now, this guy. You get to learn them. It's like all these other games. You, you slowly get to learn them and strategies against them. So, we've got Double Haste. And we've got a Ranger, so I'll keep these. Now, I should be able to move twice now. There we go. He can do a kind of berserk thing, and then he'll always, he'll have some more basic crappy goblin lads. Who are also... Those basically shield lads we, we saw before. So he's not great. Not going to do a huge amount of problems. Now, what I can do... Now, 
I could surround him. What I'll do is I'll put him there. Move him to there. Tonk him. Tonk him. And that's it. Now he will be able to attack me and kill one of those, unfortunately. Oh. <laughs> yes. There's the fact that he can attack twice. Oh, he's got two actions. Fart. Well, that was a bad strategy, lads. A bad strategy. Let's just toss a javelin at him. Nice and straightforward. Some of the more powerful cards have mana attached to them. Uh, and you've got three mana per turn. And you can do... There's a whole discard thing, but we don't need to worry about that just yet. Right, so you're a really good one. You're the Fury Master. And um, he's going to get more powerful as the game goes on, so we'll put him back there, I think. Healing Potion again. There's nothing to heal at the moment. Oh, yeah, of course, yeah, we can do that, can't we? Yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. I'm getting overconfident now, I'm not trying... Oh, here we go, is that... Um... I'm not trying hard enough to think about these things. Right, so I could try and exhaust someone. Um... And then burn, burn... apply burn to a unit, so... Mm. Well... I mean, I could try this out. But... For now... I'm wondering. We haven't got any haste, lads. I'm going to move you to there and tonk you. Now this... Oh, I should have put... I should have played her first, because that'll increase my power when I hit her. Hmm. Well. I mean, I've got two attacks with this. Oh, he's got a block hand. Mm. Well, fine. I'm going to place you... There. I'm going to place you there to increase their attacks on the next turn, irritatingly. Now, is this worth trying? No, unfortunately I can't. I can't exhaust a unit. I can't exhaust myself, I should say. I can't exhaust an already exhausted unit. So I'm just going to have to take my lumps now. He's very well protected. At all protected. So what are you lads? They're quite powerful, so as long as they don't attack me, I should be fine. Right. So I can put this... I should be able to finish him off in literally this turn. Yes, I can. It's very straightforward. Move. Thank you. You, you can't be too quick in this. So sometimes the strategy is just to go straight for the leader, even if there's like... is placing loads of lads on the board. So long as you like them, ignore them and go for the leader. It can be very useful. Okay. I might keep my weapon. I might try to... Oh, I might replace my weapon if I can get a ranged one. That would be nice. That's not a ranged one. That's an incredibly powerful blade. Four power. Hmm. That might be worth... Hmm. That might be worth a lot of things. Deal your power as damage to all units in a line. That's not great. I'll keep it. Oh, we've got a pit, another piston. Hmm. That's not great. You don't have to take them if you don't want Right, so now I might discard anything that I don't really want. I don't think I'm going to do, use that. I think I'm just going to get rid of that card. That, he's basically used to get rid of his... Well, not as many cards as you want, because you have to sp start spending treasures to get rid of them after the first one. Right, so we've basically finished this area of the dungeon now. Let's... This is just making it so I can increase the difficulty if I want. More difficulty, more loot. I'm not going to bother, because I'll probably lose then. So now we've basically opened this door back at the start of the dungeon, so now we can go this way and fight a Lizard Nest Mother level 2. Let's give him a good old face tonking. We don't really want a potion straight off, no. What, have, what else have we got? It's okay. Let's try a different one, though. That's probably better. Right, let's just double check what he's got. You can only, Oh, he's, he lays eggs. Um, eggs eventually spawn into lads. But they're not particularly that tough. He's also going to stop. Okay. So he's got archer units. Fine. I'm going to move a bit closer. This is more where I think I really, really will want to get up close and personal as soon as pos. Right, so you... In fact, I might move again. To the... Oh, I can't have already moved twice. Ignore that. So if I place him there... 
This should at um, add one to attacks for me and my bald guy. Again, this is this guy is a bit cannon fodderish because he's got one health, but Tonk you. And he's got attack of two, but he's only got one thing. So he could, he'll be able to finish me off, but it'll also mean that his. Let's move him there. I'll see. This may benefit something. <laughs> yes, he's, he's exhausted his move, which is possibly uh, useful. I don't know. Unfortunately, now he's surrounded himself with archers. Right, so we can do a damage in a line thing, although there's not really much I can do now. I think... Oh, no, I can do it for any unit. I thought it was just the hero. Well, in which case... Or I can also lay me doggy down. Hmm. Well. Th there. Let's attack you. Good. Oh, I should have, I should have, again, I keep on forgetting to lay this one down first. Well, let's do this. Move you. Do my inner line thing. Oh, I can't. Oh, I've moved. Oh, you have to do it straight off. Oh, it is actually, it is actually your hero. Okay, ignore me. Oh, is it? <laughs> Getting confused with this one. Deal your power is damaged to all units in a line from your hero, starting with an adjacent... Oh, starting with an adjacent unit. Oh, I see. So you have to have someone adjacent to you, and then it goes out from there. Okay. That's a bit more complicated than I realised. Fine. Get rid of you. He can only attack once. What's this spell? Throw a spear at target. Oh, dear. That's going to hurt. That's going to hurt me doggy. Hmm. You've got attack four. That's good. I kind of like don't want... I mean, we won't be able to get to my hero. But he'll be able to... If he moves, he'll be able to finish off that row of people. If he moves to there, he, he, he can go all those. Hmm. I think I'll get stuck in. Oh, I've already attacked with that bastard. I shall stay here. Not much else I can do. I think I've... This is less than ideal. Yeah, it's doing exactly... Oh, no, he's going that way. Oh, shit. Ouch. I know he's laid his disgusting eggs now, which I can not worry about. He's still got 13 damage. This is me not playing very strategically. So we'll be able to move... Okay. Move and tonk for four. Move and... Move and tonk. I also want to get my haste... Okay, if I lay my haste... Ooh. Hmm. Okay, I think I can ignore this, hopefully. I mean, I could get my hero stuck in. I think if I go there and attack... I'll be able to move my hero in attack. So let's put my haste in. And move him there. So I can either get my hero or I can get her in. That'll be a five attack. I won't be able to attack with that as well. I can only attack with one or the other. Shield? Well, it doesn't really matter if I lose her. Okay, Okay. whatever. Hang on. So what's he going to lay down next? That's a block unit. He'll be able to attack me for two. Uh, that's it. The thing is, if, he, if I move there and attack, he'll attack back and kill her and then be able to lay that card there. If I put myself in danger... I will end up losing two health permanently, but he won't be able to cast that last one. But he's got that dog there, so it should be okay. I think we'll prolong the battle a little bit just to protect my lad. I could give myself... Oh, I can give myself block! Actually, that would be handy. Because that will uh, negate the attack completely. But, oh, unfortunately you can lay that because of the, the adjacency to the eggs. I forgot that eggs is counter the unit. But now I can just finish him off with... What well, can't? Have to be a bit more complicated than I thought. Hang on, move. I can just have to move him back. And attack. There. Does seem to be like about getting many units on the board as possible without blocking yourself in too much. The boards aren't always 4x4, four four. they do get bigger. Oh, we've got a treasure! Which is. As well as using it as a treasure, I can also use it as a card, which does a lot of burning. It's not great, but it'll do. Got myself another bloody archer, but this time it's a bit more powerful. 
Let's go for another minion. Uh, it's just a it's just a leapy lad. Not great. Attack two. I'm not going to bother taking him. I can upgrade my, my man again. Ranged attacks with any ranged weapon gain penetrate. Ooh. I don't... With any ranged weapon. So that's... That will have to be... I'll have to swap my weapon to something else. At the moment I've got my new sword. Which is why I'm so powerful. I'm wondering whether I should swap that back to something else. But I've got no ranged weapons at the moment. So I'm not going to bother with that. What I will do is... I think... I'll make it so I get him... Increase HP at the end of each go. So what have we got? Lizard Mage or Lizard Huntress? Well, let's try this out because it's a... Uh, I don't think I've fought this one before. I suspect it'll be all about nasty spells. You can check out the, uh, the, the, the enemy's deck before you actually fight. But I don't. What well, haven't been doing. We don't really want... What is this again? No, we don't want that. That's a shield. We don't want that now. We do want dog. So let's redraw these two. Let's immediately toss a jav. Before we can do out. Um, basic lizard berserkers. We should get more powerful the more they get hurt. And you? Ranged. Only one move and one attack. But yeah, you have a rather nasty ranged attack. So I will have to try and get myself out of danger as soon as pos. If I can. I don't know if I... Again, I'm just going to try and get stuck in as soon as possible. I'll move... I think as if... Here's what I'll do. I'll move to the... Mm. Can I move to... Th there? Move my hero there. That'll put him out of the way of his ranged attack. Ha. <laughs> I think. Now, this shouldn't be too difficult. He's only got eight more health. I can attack for two. Maybe I should cast haste there and then move out of the way. Attack for two. Attack for two. Attack for three. Move. And he can move two. And bang! <laughs> Take that, you twat! Yay. Yay for me. Anyway. New spell. Never had this before. Remove two HP from your hero and give friendly minions plus one, plus one. So presumably, oh, attack and move. Maybe. I don't like that spell. The spell sucks, frankly. <laughs> um, we've got Helm Clasher. Haste and knockback. Not very powerful, but I can basically punch them back. Or if they can't be punched back, they'll take extra damage. So he's not bad. He's not a bad lad to have. Now I could spend this if if I, if I when I finish if I die and um, that um, if I don't spend that flare stone it'll be converted into gold and gold carries over into future games and you can use them to unlock things. So the more you play, the more you unlock type situation. But you do actually have to do quite a bit of playing before you really start to get into that. So no, let's keep you. What have we got? An orc Yanguard, level three. Ooh, well. Let's see what else is. Let's, let's, um, let's sneak this time. And see what else is around. We'll go straight onto the, the war drummer, I think. So there's only now a 75% chance. Let's see if we can complete the first floor. So we've got dog, we've got uh, range guy, and we've got javelin. Eh, why not? Immediate tonking. Right, so ranged dog. Just double check to see what we've got. Really reasonably robust units over here, and also they're a bit haste knockbacky. And I think I'll move them there over there. Very similar to last time. So he's protecting himself this time, although my dog is about to be probably tonked a little bit. God, they can move! Oh, got knocked back! Ooh, this is going to be positional. Right. Well, this is going to be a bit more dangerous than I thought. Well, I can I can do a dog tonk. I'll be for only for two, though. Dogs get more useful, I think, the more you have. Uh, could, then you could have a helms master, or a, a dog master, which really helps things out. But I've never actually managed to get that to, to work out yet. Uh, another 
haste guy. This is going to be another like um, sacrificial pawn guy, I think. Put him there. These lads, well, this is one is one where we'll get more and more powerful. So let's place them in the corner, and they've got a guardian. Where's the enemy? Is over there. If they any of these lads move into this space, they'll get hurt because of the guardian. Right, so I could actually attack this lad straight off. It'll put me into... Yeah, in fact, I'm going to have to. Ha. There. Actually, that's not a bad move. There. So the dog's going to be dead. He's going to be dead. But I think we should be fine. What's his spell? Oh, we've got dash as well. Gain extra moves each turn. Oh, dear. They're going to be quite move mobile, but we've, since there's only two of them, I'm not too concerned. Oh, they didn't go after my dog. Interesting. Well, dog. I'll get stuck in before I get killed. Oh, I, oh, I should have used this again. Here's what I'll do. There, now I've got five. Which means I can kill straight off. There we go. I've got to use you. Right, we've got another haste. Now, what I'll do is I'll move him there, put him there, and tonk. Uh, I don't think I need to worry about health. I'm not going to try and... Re I can't restore his health because he's not actually lost any yet. He's my pawn. Not, that, not the good kind of pawn either. Okay, move you to there, and you to there, and you to there. Not really much. I'm going to um, keep the potion for another, another battle. Right, so he's protecting himself. He's playing a more defensive game than I am. Ow! Oh, because of course they can move on their first turn. Ow. Well, first of all, give it a you. So I can attack you for two. Hmm. This is less than ideal. I've got no haste here. Oh, I've got that bloody shockwave thing. I wonder, though, if I can move myself to... Hmm. Move myself to here. Couldn't just someone there. I'm trying to see if this is going to work. What? No, that's not how it works at all. I've just killed my own bollocks. <laughs> I still haven't worked out how that works. Actually, I think I, I think I do know how it works now. Ah. Oh. Shit. I'll kill you. That was a bit of a waste, but... No! Never mind. It annoyed me, that. That was dumb. Right, so I'm going to put you there as a protection. That was a bad turn and it irritated me. Because I reckon I could have somehow found a way of winning on that round. But I should be able to win in this round. What was that? I should be able to win on this, on this go, so I should be happy enough. In fact, there. Right, gained two of my health back, thanks to that skill upgrade I had. Get myself a spell, that's shit. That just pulls someone right next to you. I'll keep it anyway. Oh, another dog! Right, I'm gonna... What are you? Spark Runner? Burn one, range two, so it's a... I can, I can attack from a distance and burn people. Yes, okay, I'll have all of them. Mystery event? Oh, I should have gone for the loot. Uh, a brawny man with three warriors in tow a costume. Hey you, take these three, destroy this place. Take warriors. Gain three helm minions. Ooh! That one costs a mana to use. Cannot move or act. Add one power to each unit you control. Oh, kind of like a ba Oh, it's a banner. Oh, very whiskey rain. I, I don't have an option. Of, I have to choose these. Okay, that's fine. Oh, there's a, there's a houndmaster I was talking about. Your, gains, your hounds gain two power. Excellent. And a fire runner. These are all good lads. Right, let's get some loot. Now, these ones are, can, are optional, I think. Yes, they are. This is another really powerful one. Add a copy of Shield 1 to your hand. What the? Copies are cards created by other cards. Oh, God. Don't even understand that one. Oh, well. This one. Into the fray. Th into the fray 3. Add a unit's current power. Unit. Oh, my God. Okay, so that's like triple. Triple power. Healing potion. Treasure. 
Plus he like does a little cloney thing. And a really bad weapon, which I'm not going to take. Let's just check to see if I can, if it's worth me swapping weapons. No, because I'm, I'm currently using the best one I've got. All right. Half full of red liquid. Is it? Isn't that just health? It is health. It gave me one thing. Uh, shopkeeper. Oh, shopkeeper. Okay, that's different. Not the temple. I've got two treasures at the moment. First one is free, so I can just buy one, get, get one for free. Let's have a look. What are you? Three flare stones. Fifteen gold. In t oh, I'm going to keep that. Yes. That'll carry. Over. Well, they'll give me fifteen gold at the end of the game, basically. Um, anything else I can swap out treasure for? It's worth thirty. There's a nice little bow. Ooh. Power three. I might have that. Get rid of you. Nice. Thanks, mate. Right, go back to the start. Doors unlocked. Now we should be able to fight a boss. But before we do that, there's a terrified adventurer. Can you spare a powerful card? I need to escape. I'll trade you this healing potion. Now. Don't want that. Right, so... I'm wondering whether I should... Oh, I've already, it's already automatically swapped to it, but yes, that's fine. Now, there was something I was going to use in con collaboration with that card ages ago, but I can't remember what that is. So, no, really. Lizard Matriarch, level four. Fight! Big board. Right, so this one will lay eggs. Little eggs and big eggs. The big eggs are bad. But, again, we just have to kill him and not worry about those too much. So I can actually... Does not affect large heroes. I don't think I can actually attack, get the enemy to do. So basically, that can piss off. What have we got? We've got a ranged guy, and we've got the shield master guy. That might be. He might be useful. Right. First of all, let's move a bit closer. Right. Let's have you. You. We can't get too close to him because he's miles away. I can't move anymore. Okay. So yes, he's going to lay his... That's an elf. going to turn into an alpha lizard. Oh, bloody hell, that was... Oh, he leaps! Oh, he's a leapy lizard. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, well, at least it gets rid of one of my less interesting things. Those are going to eventually spawn after two turns into lizards. But let's just get stuck. If it gets stuck in, that's not going to be a huge problem. That's the one we don't want to um, hatch. But it will do, irritatingly. Each turn, power increases by one. Have you... Shield. That'll be a block thing. He'll be able to go and attack immediately. What he'll probably do, end up doing is leaping over him and try to attack him. There, yeah, that's not very much. Well, do, hang on. I'll move him to there. Move him to... What's his range? I think he's only got a range of two there. Well, yeah, he's, he's not great, him. I'm trying to get stuck in to some extent. Now he can he can leap, but he can't attack leap, so if I put myself there, that'll stop him leaping. He'll basically definitely attack him then, which will open things up a little bit. Well, I could do it. I will put a shield on him. Oh block. So with any luck. Oh he's gonna he's gonna deploy some minions now, which is a shame. He might even do it from the back. But he's not gonna do that. Ha! There. My lad is still secure. Now we have got some minions on the board to fight. So I'll, what I'll do, I think, with... I've got... I've, how much... What's my range? Oh, an arcing three. That means I can attack him from here. Range three. I can't attack anyone adjacent to me, but I can do it from further away, which is rather tasty. He'll be able to attack from there. He can move... Ooh, I can, I'm going to the haste one. Let's move him to there. He... These are actually quite tough, aren't they? I did that the wrong way around. He's still alive. Bollocks. Never mind. I've already attacked with you. Um, He attacks for two. So they, they should be, actually be safe. 
What else have we got? Let's try and put in a guardian there. Um, we've got a shield for... He's going to... Let's put shield on him. We could put a shield on him again. Although he'll probably move and kill him, so I don't know. Let's put a shield on him. He's still quite powerful. And this is just another bloody ranger guy. I think I'll put him th there and maybe attack those instead. Uh, also, that. It's getting quite complicated now. We've got a lot of health, but it's already down to 20. Now they're on the board now, and the alpha's on the board now. Achievement unlocked, fun and interactive, have your minions, something, something, something. Right, s some of those deaths were because of the guardians. Moving into moving into adjacent to guardians, so that seems to have done benefits for us. Right, javelin him. Tonk him. Tonk him. I should probably... No, he can't really get close. Oh god, the alpha's right, old bastard, isn't he? 18 health as well. Right, so what I'm going to do, I think he's going to... I'm going to move over here and attack you. Get rid of you. Oh, he got a block on! Bollocks! Keep on missing that. That alpha's not really that attacky, but he's just very defendy. He's also a bit, a bit leapy as well. Hmm. I'm starting to think I should have actually been a bit more strategic on this turn. But shush. I really could do with getting rid of him. Let's put a block on you. You're still quite tasty. Give you attack from either side. Move you to there. You to th there. Not ideal, but... I'll keep you there. Get rid of you. Why not? That's all we can do, I think. Hello, you. Ouch. Haha, <laughs> didn't get him. But did get him. Oh. Unfortunately, now I'm a bit kind of... Ow. Ow, hello. Um, it's hero on hero action here. Now this time... Can we just tonk him like this? Apparently we can, yes. We've got a little doggy to um, deploy. Really want to get rid of him. Um... We haven't got any ranged units anymore, apart from me. I can't attack because of my arcing ability. It prevents it. I've already attacked with him. This is really bad. You're a, you're a ranged lad. Put you there. We've got a haste dog. At least that'll... Um, do, you, do you. And I can't... I can't do anything at the moment. Unless, hang on, move him. It's not ideal, but it gets him out of the way. Right. Bad strategies, but shush. There's a lot of those on the board now. I just need to. I'm just desperately trying to whittle the, the hero down as soon as possible. We're going to take quite a lot of lumps in the meantime. Oh my alpha! The alpha's on the on the prowl. Right. So this ain't great. However, I can heal. Oh, I, don't, I don't need to heal. Fine. Right, so this one is a weird one, which I'm going to place down. Next time we if you deploy... Oh, actually, that's going to be a bit piss. A bit pointless. That's going to turn into an enemy minion, but under my control. If once they... Oh, well, <laughs> something, anyway. Right, so what I need to do here, I think... Go down there and attack you. It's not great, but you'll have to do. Yes, I'm, I don't really have many ladders on the board at the moment. If I place you there, though, that'll protect me for a while. I'm going to get beat up a bit, I'm afraid. And, oh yes, my minion! Look, my minion... My um, my crap minion has turned into a good minion because of the that weird spell thing. Oh, I'm gonna really ow, 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 ow. 
Unfortunately, I was too slow in actually killing the enemy, and I'm being absolutely surrounded by everything at the moment, so this is bad. He's, he's well out of the way now. Now, what I could do, I'm hoping, I'm hoping, if I move him to there, and add a unit's current power to its power twice on that unit there. Oh, look! I'm suddenly better than him. Take that, you bastard! <laughs> Artifact. Uh, when an enemy minion is submitted, uh, shock the enemy hero for three damage. Cool, I have that. Um, one more. I'll go for minion. Oh, it's into the haste. Hmm. I'll go for another minion. Dog! Right, take those. And I can level up my lad! Let's do that. Four extra hit points. And I've also got a potion I can drink right now. Take me up to 15. Convert treasure into gold. Your gold will be safe if you don't escape, so I'll do that. Yep. He actually saved my life in the last one. And I've got 15 whole quids if I escape. Oh, I only keep it if I escape. <laughs> yeah. Fine, okay, so we are in a different um, level of the dungeon now, where things are getting harder and all that. Uh, but I think we've given this a good old shakedown. Um, this is either Spell Swords cards, Dungeon Top, or Dungeon Top Spell Swords cards, depending on how you actually read it on various places. All right, if you want to support the channel, keep us finding new, good new indie games, um, check out my Patreon and my soon-to-be-set-up other method of one-off donations, um, which is coming very soon, so check the link in the description uh, on the screen. Uh, see you next time.